Hi guys, today I'm going to be showing you how to make a realistic handheld camera shake, I guess. If you have an iPhone, this is great. I'm not sure if there's one for Android, but if you have an iPhone, what you want to do is download the app called CamTrack AR. Then you want to open it, and if you see down in the bottom left, there's like a square. If you look down at the ground and click that button, it will lock it in place. Then what you want to do is go to your Google Drive and locate the file and that file that you've done you want to put this one and this one into the google drive and now we have to go into blender so now when we're in blender let's go to edit preferences add-ons and search up hit film ar here and i have loads because i accidentally downloaded loads every time but if you then tick the box now you can go out and click file import hit film and then your file should be here or whatever one you chose and locate where you put that in from the google drive obviously and then import it so now that you've got that you have to try find it and you can see that it actually moves and does the motion that you want but to get it to make it actually look through the camera because as you see sorry it was really small then but as you can see, if you click on this, it goes to a complete different area or the camera that you had before, if you have another camera. So what you want to do is go to the start, bind camera to marker. And if that doesn't work, click on marker, add marker, and then click on it and then click bind. But now that you've got this, it will not move around without a plane axis. So what you want to do is add empty plane axis and then click on the camera and click on the axis holding shift right click and parent to object but now as you can see it's very small steps in a small space and you seem very short so what you want to do is scale this up most of the time depending on it and i'm gonna for example move it up here so if you hold here top left when it, you get this or top right i mean and just drag it out and then you can have the camera on this and mess it around. Also, I didn't realize when I was watching a tutorial before, to then get it back to normal, if you just look in between here, right click, join areas, and you can, whichever area you want it to go onto. So if you want this camera to be in the main screen, click that and whatever, like where you want it to do. If, just anyway, it doesn't really matter. But as you can see, the steps probably look a bit better now. But I do want to turn it around, so what I'm going to do is just swivel this round. So like this. All you need to do to make it look more realistic is turn motion blur on. If you're struggling with anything, just comment down what you're struggling with and I can reply to it. So if this helped, that'd be awesome if you could subscribe and like, and I will see you in a bit.